So um, we're in the second wave and it's a bit like the sequel of a movie uh, that you don't really want to see. I mean, most sequels are pretty bad at the movies, in my opinion. And uh, I don't think COVID's any exception, but we are where we are. So we just have to get on with it. And... Um, I mean, Contagion, which was the original film that I saw, which was where everyone wore masks and there was a deadly virus and they managed to sort it out in the movie. They only had to do one movie because they found a vaccine. Um, but obviously in real life, it's slightly different. So we haven't found a vaccine. So I was thinking, where would you end the current crisis, the current Pandemic. I think you, in Britain anyway, you'd look at the test and trace system, which is not working to full capacity. So, and it's it's stuttering and not really working very well at the moment. And we need the test and trace system in place really, really badly now, even with the current lockdown and all the rest of it. And you could have that sort of like, just starting to get better as a beacon of hope at the end of COVID-19. And as we go into COVID-20, like people are working flat out and everyone is really putting their best efforts into getting a test and trace. And then we get the vaccine at the end of the sequel. I mean, I'm hoping that there's doesn't go on and on to COVID-21 or COVID-22, which would be a bit disappointing. I mean, there were 10 Rocky movies and we watched him get older. I don't want that with COVID, but hopefully there's a vaccine anyway coming. I mean, the only thing about uh, ending with a test and trace on the first movie is it's not exactly the most exciting ending. I mean, in Contagion, they found the vaccine. Everyone was deliriously happy and they all went to church and loved each other and it was a beautiful beautiful situation we could get that in the sequel we could if we hold our nerve and stay strong uh we'll get a vaccine and you know who knows we could even so suddenly get this collective desire to solve world inequality and the climate crisis um as a real punchy ending for uh, the film, the sequel, and lots of great music. That's what I'm hoping. Cheers.